name is Raul Cardoza, and I am an IHSS consumer. A couple of years ago, I was accepted into UCLA and decided to move into their dormitories. My parents thought I was crazy. They were afraid for my safety, but I had a plan. The summer before I left UCLA, I put an ad on Craigslist looking for a leave-in caregiver. I got a response from a girl in the Midwest that wanted to go to school in LA as well. Her name was Amber, and she flew in all the way from Chicago to interview. I hired her as an IHSS provider, and she lived with my family that whole summer. We trained her as best we could, and, when the time came, we moved to LA. Neither of us had done anything like that before, and we had to grow together. She was a healthcare professional, but she got to the point where I trusted her with my life. I can tell you definitively that I would not be here today without her. I, unfortunately, had to drop out of UCLA because the state doesn't think I need 24-hour care. They cut my nursing hours simply because I turned 21. Their decision had nothing to do with my needs, but with a policy that states that you get less money as an adult than as a child. I appealed their decision and actually won, but the director of Medi-Cal overturned the decision and denied me the funding I need. I had to purchase a private insurance that costs nearly $500 a month and only covers three months of nursing care before I hit my yearly limit. I am going to hit the limit in two weeks. When that happens, I will only have 11 hours of nursing care a day. The state expects IHSS to cover the other 13 hours of the day, but I only get 96 hours of IHSS per month and the state is desperately trying to make even more cuts to the program. They are trying to balance the budget on the backs of those they think cannot fight back. I am here to tell them that I won't let that happen. I will fight, not only for myself, not only for the disabled, but also for the nurses and caregivers that, due to budget cuts, make very little money for a tremendous amount of work. IHSS allows people like myself to have independence and control over our own lives. Many people think that the disabled don't have the capacity to take care of themselves, but as Cesar Chavez once said, from the depth of need and despair, people can work together, can organize themselves to solve their own problems, and fill their own needs with dignity and strength. Let us heed the advice of the man who we celebrate today and give patients and caregivers a fair shot at life. Thank you.